Activists and CSOs have urged President Bola Ahmed Tinubu to alert the EFCC not to falsify, portray, or falsely portray Nigeria as a lawless society. At a press conference held in Abuja, a group of 60 civil society organizations represented by the Coalition for Democracy and Justice voiced their stance on the matter of the immediate past governor of Kogi State. They expressed concern over what they see as a blatant disregard for a court order prohibiting his arrest, prosecution or harassment until a substantive fundamental rights enforcement action is heard and decided upon. The convener, Barrister Ojo Olukoyode, said one of the most significant threats to democracy is when politicians manipulate the law for their own political agendas and personal vendettas along with other hidden motives. He urged President Tinubu to counsel uh, the EFCC to avoid putting itself in a position where it could be accused of betraying the independence of the courts. The CSOs uh, urged the president to reject any efforts by politicians to sway him away from one of his most trusted partners. I advise the EFCC not to make itself susceptible to any action that might be deemed as violating the sanctity of the judiciary. They must ignore the antics of all those who are urging them to commit content of court through disregarding an outstanding court order against the arrest of the former governor Yaya Adesabelo or any of his aides pending determination of the case in court in that regard as instituted by the lawyers of the former governor. The rule of law is lifeblood of democracy. Therefore, we urge the EFCC to always to the path of legality in carrying out its mandate. The Commission must deliberately avoid the temptation of falling under the pressure of disgruntled political elements but by breaking the law in their actions to uphold the law. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.